Douglas County remembers the day this country will never forget on the 20th anniversary of 9-11. Most of us remember where we were 20 years ago, except for you who weren't born yet. The solemn time when we heard the tragic news. We didn't know what to believe, what to think. We thought it was an accident. Turned out that's not the case. We had to turn the television on and we watched as the second plane hit the second tower. And we were horrified. We were afraid and we were amazed that that would happen here in America. Two thousand seven hundred and sixty three people at the World Trade Center, three hundred and forty three firefighters, twenty three paramedics from New York City police officers, thirty seven Port Authority police officers, one hundred and eighty nine people at the Pentagon, including sixty four American Airline Flight seventy seven, brave people on the Flight ninety three. But those people on 9-11 weren't able to tell their children. And they didn't sign up and raise their hand like I did when I went out of high school to go into the Army. They didn't have an opportunity to pledge to this flag and to give their lives. They didn't know that they were going to do that on that day. Douglas County and the entire nation experienced a somber day of agony but we will never be defeated. Lives lost in a moment's notice with literally no time to counteract to this attack. And God bless those of our members of our society, such as our firefighters and those who were on the aircraft and also those who worked in the buildings, just going on a normal day to, to just live their lives and, and just making ends meet for their families. Their souls were lost. I held the phone out and I stood up in the middle of the newsroom yelling, can anyone confirm if a plane crashed into the Pentagon? One of my staffers said, yes, eight seconds ago, we confirmed an airliner crashed into the Pentagon. A short time later, we learned another plane went down near Shanksville, Pennsylvania. And after the FAA shut down the airspace, which has never happened, the magnitude of the disaster sunk in. All the speakers that have been up here have talked about unity and, and, and not just unity for a couple of hours or a couple of weeks, but, but let's do it. Uh, let's make it a process that we do. Every day we get up, let's think about unity.